I have no eyebrows. God. Hi there, welcome back. We're sitting on the floor again, cause I didn't want to set up a table. So I literally am using a chair. Today I'm gonna show you guys my everyday makeup routine because I have an event to go to tonight and I have been busy throughout the entire week, again. So sit, get to So filming a video was particularly difficult for me this week and therefore I thought I would do this. Not like you asked for it, but you're gonna get it. My mirror's dirty, my brushes are kinda dirty. Like I said, I use these things every day. Cut me a little slack. I need to look presentable. Why won't this work? <laughs> okay. I usually will just like tie my hair up, but I don't have a scrunchie with me right now, so we're gonna use a little rainbow headband, cause we can't. What the heck, how do beauty gurus do this? Anastasia, Beverly Hills, dip brow pomade in soft brown. And how do I do my brows? Boom, that's an eyebrow. And then I go in with some gel again. And the eyebrow gel is from e.l.f. I can't think and do my eyebrows at the same time, so. And then I'll go in with like a... What? Hello? That's rude. I'll either use my finger or a makeup wipe and kind of go in, clean it up a little bit. And there we are. There are some Lissa Ray eyebrows. I am an eyebrows, eyes, face. Person. Depending on my mood, we might do some eyeshadow. Aquaphor. This is how I do the quick, easy eye. Elf Molten Liquid Eyeshadow. Put it close to the lash line. A fluffy brush. Blend that. Go over it a couple times. Just like that. Take a little bit of my bronzer. Eh. Dropped it. This one. Put this into the crease. Whoa. Why is that like red? Blend everything so that you don't look stupid. Ta-da! See? Then if you're feeling really fancy, you can go in with the eyeliner. It's the e.l.f. H2O Proof Eyeliner Pen. I also haven't done a wing in a long time. Kind of like that. And they're uneven. I'm going to fix that. This is why I like to do my eyes and brows first, is so that I don't have to go in with concealer after I've already done my foundation and get it looking all cakey on like little baby hairs. At this point in time, before I do anything else, I would go in with my Morphe setting spray, but I am out. I don't do my lashes. I do that last. NYX Conceal Correct Contour in Light. Take these top two colors, go around parts of my face that need a little extra love. Just tap it right over. Personally, I'm totally okay with having some of my flaws show, which is why I literally only spot conceal. I don't like the way foundation makes me feel. So this is just to kind of even things out. Hello. Hello, darling. What's up? How come you're the only one who answers the phone in my family? Because I love you the most. Aww, that's a nice answer. Are, are you filming your makeup? I am. See you soon. Bye. 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 The darkness under my eyes helps contour my nose. Fun fact, when I was in fifth grade, I broke my nose right here. So like it has this little like bump right here and it's just slightly wider. And to be honest, I think if I had never broken my nose, my nose would be so cute. I'll take what I can get. At least I can breathe. At least I have a nose and I don't completely hate it. So, and sometimes when I'm feeling a little fancy, I'll go in with the contour color. Lightly tap that under my cheekbones. You know what I did recently? I totally caved. I downloaded TikTok. And I kind of don't hate it. Like, it's pretty entertaining. I also go and I hide my double chin. That I try to get rid of a little bit. See that? Boom. A little bit of definition. Nothing crazy. And then I go to blush. Because I don't like to look as dead as I feel on the inside. So what I've been doing is I've been using lipstick. This is a Wet n Wild lipstick in Bare It All. And I just kind of... <coughs> this is what's been working for me. And then I just really lightly just kind of pat it on. I don't mind being pink. It'll remind me of like my really bad sunburn days. And then this is the kicker. The whole blush on the nose thing. I do it, but I don't do it on the tip of my nose. I don't like looking like I'm straight out of Whoville. And right where I'm, the bump in my nose is from where I broke it. This is like contouring my nose and I'll just tap it right on top. Ta-da. I'll take my bronzer, take like a fluffy brush, 
and I go boop, 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 just a little bit, and then just a little bit right over my contour, and I just kind of tap it in between the blush and the contour, and I'll take some bronzer, and I'll put it on the tip of my nose, and then I blend it out. It stopped recording right when I said boom. Now, this is my little thing. Uh, because it was broken. This part sticks out, and this part goes in, and this part sticks out, and this part goes in. Granted, I wear glasses, so you kind of can't see this anyways, but I will take a little bit of highlight, put a little bit right here, and then I blend everything out. I would usually go in with my setting spray. I don't have any. It goes... Disappointed! So remember this Aquaphor from before? Aquaphor. I put it on my lips because that's what it's meant for. Tap off like the excess on the back of my hand and I'll go along my cheekbone. But if I'm feeling fancy, I'll put highlight on top of it. I use the Mary Luminizer. I don't use one of those tiny little precise brushes. I use a straight up like fluffy brush. And then I also put a little bit of highlight around. A little bit under the brow. And a little bit on the chin. Glowing. Have you ever seen those like videos where they're like, oh, if you heat up your eyelash curler with a lighter, you'll get a better curl. Well, I did that once, but I guess I got it too hot. It melted the rubber, so I just put tape over it and it, it works fine. So I'm gonna curl my lashes, put on some mascara. that and now to finish it off our lipstick blush and we take our hair out of this and then we fluff it up Ta -da! I look like a human so with all of that being done and said I want to say thank you for watching this video if you enjoyed it give it a big old thumbs up and if you want to see more content like this in the future hit the subscribe button and the notification bell right next to it so that you never miss one of my posts, which are every Sunday at noon PST. My merch link is down in the description below. Pick up some merch. I would greatly appreciate it if you did. Either way, I love you. Thank you so much for watching this video, and I will see you in my next video. Bye! Ugh. Also, if I want like a glossier lip, but I don't want to use actual lip gloss because it gets all sticky, this is my buddy, my buddy pal. I love this stuff. Boom, instant glossy lip.